More than half of California households with low incomes have difficulty paying for basic expenses such as food and housing. In 2022, nearly 1.7 million children in California likely fell back into poverty or deeper into poverty because of the expiration of the federal child tax credit. We have a proven method to radically reduce poverty with tax credits like the Cali ATC and Young Child Tax Credit targeted to low-income families. The research shows it, but more importantly, families who receive these payments know it. We believe in the power of coalitions built on lived experience and addressing root causes of poverty. We build community connections where our families work, live, and play. Progress, like ensuring tax credit amounts are meaningful to families and are enough to help with the cost of living, requires that leaders are willing to commit and put their political power on the line. It requires dedication that lasts more than just a single legislative session, requires years. I authored these bills because income inequality was hitting the hardest in our communities, and in the working class community that I represent, people were standing in food lines for over 12 hours just to get a meal on the table. These bills look towards helping people. Tax credits are a remarkable tool to be able to put money into the pockets of the California families that need it the most. And they're transformative in nature. They lift people out of poverty. They change the trajectory of entire families. In 2022, these tax credits brought more than $9.6 million back to the California capital region. That is a significant investment back into our community. The way that we spend those locally in the community helps our business community thrive as well. It's a circular economy. And the more we spend in our neighborhoods, the more our neighborhoods grow, thrive, and build together. Tax credits have been proven over and over again to reduce entry into child welfare, to increase health among children. And we know that these work. There's a lot that we can do to expand upon them. I plan to make tax credits a priority. We have to do it because people depend on it in the state of California. And this is a way to tackle income inequality right at the heart of what people need, which is more money in their pockets. We have come together to ensure that our policymakers are listening to the families that are hurting. They should stand with them when they're making decisions on the California budget. Tax credit advocacy is a starting point for system change, and we urge California legislators to join us in the fight. We are a movement. We are growing. We are engaged in good work and good trouble. We share a powerful mission. But making lasting change for California takes a village. Join us as we work to ensure every Californian has what they need to thrive in the Golden State. Together, we can build economic justice for all.